All right, let's talk about the reserved lanes. So making a right turn from a road that has an HOV lane onto a road that doesn't have an HOV lane. So when you're coming up to make a right turn, we have to turn from the closest edge of the road, right? So from the curb lane. Now if this curb lane is an HOV lane, uh, that's fine, we can go into it. Uh, so when the examiner says turn right at the next intersection and you're dealing with an HOV lane, um, you can generally enter into this HOV lane about half a block before your turn, um, but no more than a block away, okay? Uh, so the students should be thinking, all right, uh, the rightmost lane is an HOV lane, I'm permitted to go into that lane for a maximum travel distance of 60 meters before making a right turn. So we signal shoulder check, check for any buses or any other vehicles in this lane, and we'll come into this lane so we can make the maneuver like so. Uh, we cannot turn wide at this intersection and presume that um, just because this is a HOV lane, we cannot go into it and turn wide, okay? Now, on the flip side of things, uh, if you're coming up to make a right turn on a road uh, with an HOV lane, so you're turning onto this road and it's got an HOV lane, uh, we're not allowed to go into this HOV lane and then switch out of it and go to another lane. Uh, and very often you'll find a sign like this posted uh, that says curb lane of the cross street ahead is a reserved lane. So that's what it, this is telling you and it's got this sign. So look for the signage because it's gonna help you figure out what kind of road you're turning onto. The same idea on the road test exam, I say, turn right at the next intersection and the student should be thinking, oh yeah, there's a sign there telling me that the first lane is an HOV lane, so when I make my turn, I need to go into the second lane, okay? So long story short, you can go into the HOV lane to turn from it, but we can't turn into an HOV lane or a bus lane, okay? now. Uh, the only time you may be permitted to go into the HOV lane is if it's a, if it's a shared lane. So it says like um, two people can be in this lane. So if it's, a, it's like a car, car share um, lane. So if sometimes it says HOV lane, but cars with two passengers or more can be traveling this HOV lane. In that case, if you have two passengers in your vehicle and you're coming up and you're making a right turn into a HOV lane that has that um, differentiation, then yes, you can go into that lane as well. But uh, if it doesn't, it's just a bus lane, um, then you need to stay out of it as you're turning into a new road, but you can go into it for a short period of time if you're gonna be making a turn from it.